giving away in America like a bunch of pussies. The only country that's ever been conquered with words. Don't believe me? Listen to this clown. It's just a mask, you guys. Don't be a jerk. It's for the greater good. <laughs> it's just a vaccine, you guys. Don't be a jerk. It's for the greater good. <laughs> In four months, the U.S. was transformed into an obedient socialist country. Government dictated what events are acceptable to attend. Violent protests that instill fear are okay. But church services, family funerals, and patriotic celebrations are dangerous. <laughs> and you bought it without a fight. <laughs> Standing in a graduation line is a safety hazard. Small businesses were forced to close, but crowds to support the corporate money machine at Walmart, Lowe's, and Home Depot are okay. <laughs> Come on! It's just a mask and safety precautions. <laughs> How about a little hush money? <laughs> Here's $2,400 that we stole out of your paycheck in the first place. Enjoy. Buy something with it from a big corporation. Cash is dirty. We can't give change. There's a coin shortage. Use your card. <laughs> In four months, they convince you to use a traceable card for everything. <laughs> In less than four months, government closed public schools, then restructured education under the guise of public safety. In less than four months, our government demonstrated how easily people assimilate to guidelines that have no scientific premise whatsoever. If you are fearful. <laughs> In less than four months, our government successfully instilled fear in a majority of the population in America that allows them to control every aspect of your life, including what you eat, where you go, who you see, and your neighbor. And the most dangerous and terrifying part, people are not afraid of the government who removed their freedom. They're afraid of their neighbors, family, and friends. <laughs> and they hate those that won't comply. Absolutely terrifying to me that so many people don't question authority. They are willing to surrender their critical thinking skills and independence. They just gave up without thinking, without a fight. Do you know what's coming next? It's just a vaccine. Come on, it's for the greater good. <laughs> Wait until you're told that you can't enter any store or business without proof of the COVID-19 vaccine. Wait until you can't go to public events or get on a plane without proof receiving the vaccine. Don't think it's possible? <laughs> Will you already allow the government to say when you can go outside? Where you're allowed to go and accept it? A new unproven digital education for your kids in the last hundred days? You followed blindly because you were told to do so. You're kidding yourself. That behavior won't be repeated with a vaccine or whatever the next step is. <laughs> I don't follow politics. I don't care about that stuff. I don't think about it. Six million Jewish. Now, that clown has basically just taken everything I've told you since the beginning of the year and compiled it into a nice, neat little amount. I cut him off when he started talking about the six billion, million Jews that died because I ain't going that route. I don't agree with it. But he's absolutely...